What's up everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm gonna talk about how to show FPS in game using MSI Afterburner and how you can use it. So let me directly get into a step. So first one, just go over here on a Google Chrome and just close everything over here I'm having, just get into the Google Chrome. And right now what we need to do is we just need to go over here, search for MSI Afterburner over here like this. Just go over here and this is the official site, just get into this. And right now, once you get into this, you'll be getting these options. So just click over here, closest at the top and click on this one over here. So it's actually the final version. And it is going to take a bit of time. I think it is around 56.2 MB, which is not big, not so big. So it's just been to wait. And once it's installed, we need to install it. So while installing, there are a few things that should be taken aware of or else you'll be having the trouble. So just wait for this to get completely downloaded. And now just go over here, click on this particular folder over here and just click on this one. And right now just click over here so that you want to install it. So just run it over here like the setup should be run over here. You have to run it and it will be installed on your system. Now you just need to go over here, go for the install, just click on the install icon over here. So it's not big deal as it is, it is just like the normal way of installing. We just need to wait a little bit of time because it's going to get loaded up. And just go for the yes. And right now select the language English and go for the next. And I accept the terms and conditions, go for the next. And make sure while doing this, you should be selecting the Riva Tuner static server as well. That's also an important one. Just select it and go for the next. And go for next, go for install. So it's going to take a little bit of time to install it over here. So just wait it. So, so once it's successfully installed over here, so just wait it over here and just go for over here. And once it's successfully installed, you have to close this and we just need to wait for this one to run in the background and once it's successfully installed you have to check few more things just go for ok and go for next accept the agreements go for next go for next go for install and just wait because right now the reward tuner is being installed over here like this Finish, finish. And right now, close everything over here. And this is the installer, okay? So this is the MSI. And there is a few things that you need to take care of. The first one, if you don't find any values here, just go over here in the settings. And right now, navigate to the monitoring over here. And over here, what we need to do is, we just need to scroll down and navigate to the monitoring over here at the top. And right now, we need to scroll down over here, something called frame rate. So we'll be having the frame rate over here. So right now, you can see we have frame rate. So make sure it is selected. And once the frame rate is selected, all we have to do is just go over here, put a check on this one, and also go over here in this particular one, show in screen display over here. And right now, over here, you can set this to text. I'm going to keep this to text. And once after it's successfully done, go for apply and go for OK. And right now, you can see you'll be able to see the frame right over here without any issue. So this is how you can use this. And I hope this video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. That's it. Bye-bye.